in the vast amount of miles run from all of the NCAA cross country runners across the entire world, only two stars from the 2023 season have blazed a trail like no others. Caitlin Tui and Parker Valby, two athletes whose journeys met and formed into a clash of titans across the 2023 cross country season. And the events that ensued turned into a rivalry that redefined everyone's thoughts on who is the greatest female NCAA cross country runner of our era. As we unravel the cross country saga of Kaylin Tui and Parker Balby up until the next time that they're gonna be racing here soon, share with us in the comments. When did you first witness the magic of Tui and Valby? For me, it was sometime a bit before the 2023 Outdoor Track Championships, where we saw Parker Valby come back from an injury and crush a 5,000 meter to win a title that many thought was destined for Tui. But Kaylin Tui, as a junior in college at the time, did indeed scratch from the 5,000 meter championship final after she originally was aiming to win both of the 1,500 and 5,000 meter titles on the same day. This 5,000 meter track championship race perfectly sets up the stage for us to run straight into the epic 2023 cross country season that begins just a few months later. The clear favorite going into the cross country season is, of course, Caitlin Tui. She's a prodigy who's blossomed into a titan and is now a professional athlete who's no stranger to record breaking performances. From her dominating high school tracks to becoming an NCAA sensation, she has always been one step ahead. And now in 2023, Caitlin Tui is taking on her final cross country season as a collegiate athlete going up against the less favored, but still very well respected Parker Balby, who is now known to face her challenges head on, especially after she transformed her broken foot setback in 2022 into stepping stones to reaching the very top of the NCAA. Each journey is unique, yet, both are united by two races of their four total in the 2023 cross country season. Their encounter at the Nuttycomb Invitational in Wisconsin was not only a highlight of their need for speed, but it was also a preview of the wonders that these two are bringing to this season's NCAA championships. Valby, facing adverse weather, didn't just compete, she excelled, breaking a six kilometer course record in 1917 and outpacing the competition including the season Tui who ran through the finish over 10 seconds later than Valby at 1929. This rivalry exists so well because of how they're pushing each other to excel with each race, setting the stage at the heart of the NCAA cross country season where lies the NCAA cross country conference championships. A decisive battleground where Tui of NC State takes on the ACC while Valby from the University of Florida faces the SEC. Now guess, which one of these two runners achieved a victory that not only solidified her status as a leader, but also propelled her team to their 8th consecutive team title? Yep, you guessed it, Caitlin Tui. Defending her individual crown and SC State's title in a dominant fashion, she was able to clinch her second consecutive ACC individual championship title. Not to be overshadowed by Caitlin Tui and NC State's win over in the ACC, but Parker Valby in the SEC was facing her own set of challenges. After rising from consistent and devastating foot injuries at the SEC Championships in South Carolina, she somehow managed to beat her conference to qualify for the NCAA Regional Champs. Valby's performance was nothing short of spectacular. I told you, the saying, I do this for my squad, I do this for my gang. I told them to channel that in her song, and we all, we all channeled it in for each other. Outpacing her competition by a staggering 30 seconds, and leading the Gators to their first SEC cross country title since 2012 with a pace of 312 per kilometer or 510 per mile. As both athletes geared up for the NCAA regional champs, the course for the big and final NCAA championships race is beginning to become set for an epic showdown between Tui, the enduring champion of the Southeast region, and Valby, the comeback queen of the South regional. As we look ahead, the question that looms large is not just about who will be first place, but about the legacies that these athletes will leave behind. Will Tui extend her reign, or will Valby's resurgence culminate in a championship title? No need to wonder, because the season-long anticipated Tui v Valby showdown at the 2023 NCAA D1 Cross Country Championships has all the answers for us. This race brought together the nation's elite 
with all eyes locked on the prestigious Caitlin Tui and Parker Valby. Their journey up to this point have been full of breathtaking races and a rivalry that has become the heartbeat of collegiate running, setting the stage for an unforgettable clash in Charlottesville, Virginia. Against the backdrop of a sold out venue, the race was more than a test of speed. It turned into a testament of pure guts, strategy, and the sheer will to see who wants it more. Parker Valby, emerging from a season of formidable performances, seized control of the 10K race from the start. And she ended it with a victory, striking 18 minutes and 55 seconds, which wasn't just a win that marked a perfect season. It was also a message, a message saying that she is here to stay and here to shatter records. While Tui, who faced challenges of health from her illness, she was able to showcase a level of performance that was for more than just herself. Her fifth place finish at the NCAA championship race was pivotal in securing NC State's third consecutive team title by a mere point over Northern Arizona. This single moment of triumph against the odds cemented Caitlin Tui and NC State's legacy in NCAA history. Although Tui and Valby's paths are diverging for a short period of time, with Tui going pro and Valby remaining to terrorize the NCAA, the legacy of Tui and Valby's rivalry will continue to inspire. And we all know if we get a chance to see these two go toe to toe on the line anytime this season, we will have a complete battle on our hands. Now let's go ahead and dive into the numbers, setting these athletes apart with some head to head comparisons of their personal best. That way we can showcase the depth of their talent. Starting with the mile, a classic test of speed and endurance, Caitlin Tui clocked an impressive 424 indoors while Parker Valby, with her relentless pace, has a mile best of 451. The difference of nearly 30 seconds speaks volumes about the racing strategies and training focuses. Now, moving up a bit to the 3000 meters, an event that demands both tactical savvy and raw power, Tui shines with an 835, showcasing her unparalleled ability to dominate the indoor track from the mile to 3000 meter level. While Valby, she's not too far behind in spirit. She posts a personal best of 849, a testament to her gritty and front running style. Now moving up to the 5000 meters is where these two meet their perfect match for each other. It is a grueling test of endurance. This race sees Parker Valby setting a blistering pace with a record of 1456, a time that not only showcases her extraordinary stamina, but also her ability to push the limits. Tui, with the personal best of 1503, combines her strategic racing intellect with pure speed, making every race a spectacle. Yet she's still about 10 seconds under Valby's personal best. After seeing the numbers, experts have weighed in, noting that while Tui's range and versatility have led to multiple collegiate records, Valby's focus on specific distances have honed her ability to excel in longer races. So, what do these numbers even tell us about the future of their rivalry? With Tui transition to professional running and Valby continuing to define her legacy in college at the University of Florida, the track is set for more record-breaking performances and unforgettable moments when Valby goes pro after college. The saga of Tui and Valby is far from complete. With the Olympic trials and international championships on the horizon, the Caitlin Tui and Parker Valby rivalry promises to elevate the sport. Who will emerge as the beacon of distance running in the years to come? The journey is unpredictable as it is thrilling. Follow their journey, support women's distance running, and subscribe for exclusive updates right here. As always, we'll be seeing you the next time we bring runners to you.